Alright, hey you guys, thank you so much for dropping by my channel and today I have a sticker collection to share with you guys, my updated sticker collection. Now I have a new container for them, they're in my boxes that I picked up from work and I just separated my um, puffy stickers with a flat sticker. So I have two boxes full of stickers. But before I start that, I'm just going to show you guys real quick about these masks. Um, you know whenever they come and you get them in the mail or what have you when you buy them, they have the yellow strings on them. But since I've had this for a long time, they wore out. So I just replaced them with the rubber headbands that I found at the Dollar Tree. And then I used my pliers to put them back on there. Now they said that you know stuff could last here for a while but when I used to work at the factory whenever the filter would get dark I would change it out that's the only time I did it but till then I kept reusing them which was the purpose of that because it was sawdust and I would put them back on if they weren't that dark but you see it's still clean but they said with with what's going on right now that it could be there for two weeks or so. But I don't know if it, it'll it's wearable for two weeks. But usually, like I said, when I used to work at the sawdust place, it will get like dark. You will see it change colors from white to like the whole thing will change. And the filter, like the center of it, it'll change. But so far, this one's still okay. I mean, it has some stains, but it's fine. So like I said, I just reused, or not reused, I just changed the string to a head headband piece that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. And I just cut the extra um, stuff on it. And then, yeah, I could use it again. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with the sticker collection. I don't know if... I don't have a stand, so I'm going to just hold you guys. This is the letter one. I think I have a few of the letters. And I'm not going to show you guys the current ones that I'm using. These are the brand new untouched ones. And these stickers I find randomly here in the area where we live. And this is my Hello Kitty mat, if you guys can't tell. I think this is a yeah, that's what it looks like on the uh, on the flip side. They're like zoo animals. That's breast cancer. And this is like a slew of letters. There's a bunch in there. This, the googly eyed one. Oh, there's a, hmm, there's some puppy stickers that got in this box. Oh, uh, yeah, because this is excess from the other box, because my puffy stickers. I have more puffy stickers than the flat ones. I'll move that over there. See if it, it might fit. Oh, those are the Christmas tags. I also placed them in here. 
See, you guys see? I, I don't take out the price all the time. And then I just labeled it flat stickers. So I know when I look for stuff that that's what's in that box when I open it. This is a Halloween. Christmas. Oh, these are all Christmas labels and tags. I think I got these at the Dollar General. I think I got this one at Target. At the Dollar Spot. Uh, I think I got this at Big Lots. Yeah, I'll post big, big Lots. When they used to sell stickers. Yeah, see? Um, that sticker is a Big Lots. Yeah, but because they don't sell as much anymore. Those. Oh, sorry about that, you guys. I think that one's from the Dollar Tree. I think this one might be Dollar General or Dollar Tree. Because I guess get most of my stickers from the Dollar Tree. Like these. These are Dollar Tree. Yeah. That brand or that look. And yeah, you, I'll know if it says on the back um, Green Briar. That's them. That's Dollar Tree. I don't know. I think this one uh, might be pricier, so that might be Hobby Lobby or Michaels or one of them bigger stores, cause or AC Moore or something. Cause they sell fancier ones and they're more very expensive, even though they come from the same area or the same place. They just price them more because they're bigger stores. Now, the Target has a dollar spot. I think I picked up some of these, too, at Myers. I think this one's Target. <laughs> mm, that might be Dollar Tree because it's Jot. Okay. You guys would recognize some of them. I think I also picked up some from eBay because they have a lot of vendors there. A lot of people that sell them. And then, of course, Walmart. I think I even got some from Kmart before Kmart shut, shut down. Yeah, that's Dollar Tree. Look how cute. <laughs> um, this one's um, Dollar General. Art Skills is a Dollar General um, brand. I think this is a Hobby Lobby. And you can tell because they, they're kind of fancier. <laughs> And they're different. Okay, this is kind of raised up. They're not really flat stickers. I'll put them in my puffy, puffy pile. I know, this can take forever, you guys. Better hurry up. Um, Pokemon. See, that was Walmart. You can tell. I, I didn't take it out. Because I was able to cut. Nobody had a sale. I don't always go to the store. Well, I try to take a peek, but here lately I haven't really been. Not like before. Before I used to go like every day. <laughs> okay. Just about every day. Now I don't.
because of the pandemic. It's okay. Alright, this one's hmm, Heartland paper. Must be those fancy stores or the craft store. Craft mall, maybe. I don't know. I've been through so many places that I don't remember everything. Oh, I think I got this one from the thrift store. Because, yeah, from Goodwill. It's like a whole sticker book of stickers. Sticko is a uh, Walmart. I see. All right, you guys can see. Ooh. I think this one is Dollar Tree. Like I said, you'll see it in the back. Um, yeah, they're mowing the yard, so you guys will hear all kinds of noise. I think I got this one. This, the American Greetings, I think I got that from the craft now. And yeah, and they're already limiting the customers at Kroger today. And the rest of the other stores. Like, they're limiting the number of people in there. I don't know how accurate that is, but there's a limit on them. Like, you can only have, you know, up to how many people in there. So, that's good, you know. We don't want this stuff to spread even more. And have to deal with it two weeks later or a month later. If people would just listen. Well, not unless they're looking for a death wish. They might as well put a bullet over their heads, right? Because that's basically what's going on. You can't dodge a bullet, can you? If it's meant to hit you, but don't be out there trying to catch it. <laughs> you know, that's kind of creepy. I mean, we're all already pumped up with meds that are susceptible to this thing. And you're out there trying to catch it or spread it. That's not cool. I think, I don't know. I think I got that from the craft mall. Because sometimes they divvy up the stickers per package. And then, like I said, I still have a box of the ones I'm using right now. Like, present at the present time. But I'm not going to show you guys that one on this collection. I'm just showing you guys the ones that have not been touched. Oh, that's not a sticker. It's a gift sack. <laughs> I need to move that. Butterflies. Look at that, you guys. Isn't that cute? Okay, this is another gift tag. I'll move that one. Okay, now <laughs> I have a sack of these stickers that are like loose, they're not in a package. 
and but they're in this sack and they're assorted you guys like there's the money stickers there's some name tags some labels some other stickers but i'm not gonna pull them out of there because yeah it looks like yeah i'm not even gonna bother with that one i'll just leave it in there i think those are the ones without the packaging like, they're not like this. They're loose. But they're still full sets of stickers. St. Patrick's. Easter. Yay. Look at that. Easter. Are these stickers? Oh, no. They're felt. Okay, I need to take that out of this box, too. I think sometimes I just stick it in there once I get one. Oh, look. There's another tag. And another tag. Okay, I need to take that out too. And this is the last of my numbers on that. Um, my flat sticker box. So I'm going to switch you off, guys. And I'll be right back. Alright, you guys. So my puffy sticker box is just overflowing. Like. There's a whole ton of my puffy stickers. So I'm going to try and show you guys the stickers. This one's my uh, me and my big ideas. I think at some the bigger stores. That's the Goba. I think I also got some of this at Kroger and CBS. Because there's, there's like a dollar aisle that you go to and you can see stuff like stickers in there. And like I, like I said, you know, when they need stickers, I give them as gifts as well. The kids, they need it for their friends. They just let me know and then I tell them to go through the box. And then when I do friend mail, I also put some in there. Or like my giveaways. I think this is from Big Lots. This is the chipboard stickers. And they're the thicker. And this one's uh, the outer space. This one must have been probably so out. I should have kept it in a Ziploc bag like I did the other one. That's what happens if I don't put them in a Ziploc bag. These are, I think these are Dollar Tree. These are nowhere ones. The Crusty Square. And this one's Walmart. I know that for a fact. Because I didn't take out this sticker. Yeah, I did that on purpose so I know who sells, you know, where I found it. And this is Walmart, too. I love Walmart. Oh! Yep, there, there goes that. They're all over the place now. <laughs> Hold on, you guys. Yeah, I love Walmart and the Dollar Tree because they sell all the cool stuff that I like. Oh, uh, this is Hallmark. That must be from a fancy store. And uh, this is Dollar Tree. And I also have some felt stickers. They're so cute. This from the Dollar Spot, Target Dollar Spot. I think this one's from the Dollar General. Look at how cute you guys. Look at little elves. Ta-da! All cats and dogs. This is a police officer. Yes, Mr. Police Officer. Say much respect. Because they are also an essential part of the pandemic. Y'all just need to listen. 
They're having them big parties and stuff. Be considerate to other people. They're just doing their job. You guys giving them a headache and something to worry about when they could be doing other important things than keep babysitting you guys. Jesus. Y'all are grown. Y'all don't need to be babysat. Do the right thing. It's pitiful. This one's a St. Patrick's Day. Look at that. Large gatherings are not allowed. Not right now, you guys. Y'all should know better. Street parties are not allowed. <laughs> Ain't gonna happen. Christmas numbers. Paisley's butterfly and turtles. Aren't they cute? Adorable, you guys. The pot of gold. I think I got this one from CVS, you guys. Isn't that adorable? I'm so glad I caught that that day. Whatever day I caught that. Slide it on over the place. Okay. This looks like a Christmas Oh, they're gift tags. Okay, they shouldn't be here. I'm going to put that in my gift tag box. How about that? Yeah, these, these are gift tags. Okay, Christmas stickers from the Dollar Tree. Aren't they adorable, you guys? Look at that. That is just adorable. I think this one's from eBay. Look, you guys, it's the army. Thank you to our military personnel. They're also part of this. I mean, we're all a part of it, really. But just some are a little more out there than the others. So if you you guys are crafty. You guys could create so much crafty things right about now. New board games. New things to do while you're in quarantine. Books to write. Research. Books to read. To paint. To color. To repair. Especially if you guys have homes. They all need to be updated, like maintenance, clean your vents, spot back your carpets, fix your basements, your garages, organize things. Now is a great time to do all of those things if you guys aren't on the road or out and about. Decorate your yard, plant some veggies. For your garden, get your seeds ready. Do coloring books with your kids. Play board games, video games. That one's a puffy one. I have to leave that one out. The online schooling thing. Keep up with that because. Most kids are doing online schooling.
you know, cooking, baking, you know, stuff like that. Get you a hot bath, get some tea going, have your little drink, don't get drunk. Just have you a few drinks. Make you like a little mini bar. Don't be a lush. Just, you know, have a few sips. Be an adult about things. Be a mature adult, responsible adult. Learn about good manners and right conduct. Learn about etiquette. Personal hygiene. Arrange your hoard in your basement. Arrange your hoard in your barn. Put them in boxes, put them in totes. This is a sack of those loose puffy stickers. I usually keep them, but if I haven't used them and they're still new, I leave them in, I leave them in the Ziploc bags. Because they usually come like this. So when they're brand new, they come and pack like these. Make you like a photo album of the places that you've been to, print them off. Like a scrapbook of your travels. Sing a song, dance. Learn a new dance step, make a new dance step. Don't do stupid stuff like that will add to the situation, you know? I know it's hard because sometimes I feel that way too. I get frustrated and stuff like that, but. We all get that way. But be thankful for what you have and where you're at. Because some people would like to be where you're at. You know? You never know. Like you're stuck in an island somewhere. Maybe someone wants to be stuck in a beach where this thing is going on. So appreciate the smell of the ocean, the calming sound of the waves, the sunset, the sunrise, things like that, you know? The peace, the tranquility. It doesn't have to be all hustle and bustle all the time. Sometimes it's nice to enjoy a cup of tea or some gin and vodka by the ocean. Gin and juice. <laughs> Life's too short, you guys. If you're on the mountainside, enjoy the mountain view. If you have friends that have farmland, help them in their farm. In their little gardens. Yard work is always awesome. That was one of the past times when my dad was still alive. That's what he used to do. He'd do a lot of yard work. He'd stay in there, get all the rodents, you know, make sure they're not making holes in the yard. If they do, if you guys don't pay attention, those rodents will put holes. Those gophers. They'll put holes in your property or your land, period. What is this? Oh, they're gift tags. Okay. I'm going to take that out because that's not a sticker. My mom, she has a stroke, so usually indoors except to see you know doctor or if they're going to visit 
stuff like that. So, you know, they watch TV, read books, stuff like that. She lives with my family in another state. I don't want her to worry, so I make my videos and stuff, and they just watch it. Let them know I love them and I miss them. And we do FaceTime with them. We're almost done, you guys. If you guys have any questions on my video, feel free to send me an email. Because like I said before, I will turn off my comment box and my subscriber count. Because it's like stagnant right now. It's, stand, uh, it's sitting on a standstill. So it's not moving. So in that case, once I do reach a certain point, then I'll open all of them. Because right now, I'm just sharing with you guys my experience and what's going on. There's no need to comment or any of that stuff. And I'm not doing a giveaway, so I can't really open it. I'm just showing you guys a video. But when I do reach a certain point and a certain goal, I will open it up. And, you know, you guys could participate or if I have a contest or something like that I will do that but right now at the present time I don't have any of that going on so I apologize if you guys can spam comment my channel because there's really no need to just watch the videos you know I don't get paid by YouTube or any of that stuff this is all my stuff that I work for outside of YouTube so there's it doesn't count like you know it doesn't um how do you say? It doesn't really count for anything. It just says a lot of people are watching it. That's it. I mean, I don't get anything from it. I mean, I'm a YouTube partner, but I'm not um, directly getting paid by Google. So, but I did get paid at one point because I, I think I had a video that was a lot, and then they changed the rules again that you have to have a thousand and you have to have so many watch time like really okay whatever so <laughs> i'm just gonna shut it you know like cover it all up 